So I thought we'd start it out different today, guys. Here's the Tom Reefer Studio. New viewers, this is where I think of my ideas for the videos. I meditate. I got some entertainment. I think about life. Some viewers ask, is this actually the bedroom? And I said, well, it's a spare bedroom or guest room, whatever you want to call it. But it's now the Tom Reefer Studio. So here you have the 20 gallon mixed reef cube. Up top here, you have the new five gallon nano, LPS dominated. Back here, you have the six gallon tall. And over here, we have the 10 gallon peninsula. And you guys have been following. Look at the comeback the hair algae has made. I've gotten rid of it. Two 50% water changes and I'm in there with my hands and fingers and tweezers pulling it out. It's going away. And we're also going to visit Sydney, Australia and it's all gonna happen, of course, right here. Thank you guys again for all the nice things you say about the channel, about me. I appreciate it. That's what keeps me going, guys. You know, if I know I'm a value to some of you guys out there, then I'll keep making them. I'd love to see the channel really grow and explode. Maybe I should do a call for you guys, whether you're on Instagram, wherever. Just send the word out. I'm sure you probably have shared already, but I think it just takes time. You know, we can only reach so many people so fast. I guess it's not about growing, you know, it's about the few. What, would, what did they say in the Star Trek movie? The, the one, somebody give me that line. The one that, the needs of one, no, the needs of many, outweigh the needs of the one. That was a great line. I think Spock said it just before he died. I remember in the glass and he was getting radiation. All right, so it's been some time for reef tanks around the world. Today we're gonna go visit Sydney, Australia and check out Richard's tank. He's got a lot of cool DIY contraptions and stuff going on in the back. I'm going to check in with him now to see if we can get him to give me a description before I put all this together. So let's get right into it today. Maybe shorter video, I don't know yet, but let's get right into it. Let's take a trip to Sydney, Australia and check out Richard's 30 gallon. guys we're gonna play a little game now it's gonna be called guess the component on Richard's setup now I know these are the cooling fans but I have a corresponding number to each component you guess by the number leave it in the comment let's see who can guess the most components it's number one this is number Number three, number four, number five. Well, we won't give that one a number. Six, seven, eight, and nine. All right, good work, guys.
So that was a very cool tank. Richard's been around a long time. He's a super smart guy. He always adds great comments. And I like the do-it-yourself stuff. I think it's really, really cool. It's a young tank, and like I said before, any of these young ones we show, we'll revisit in a year or so to see the progress. All right, guys, that should do it for this one. Over. Over.